Dear residents of Mkana, thank you so much uh, for joining us. Uh, my name is Binwa Mkundu, MP for Mkana Constituents. I have uh, some very exciting news. Uh, that is to say that uh, the Nkana media team has embarked on uh, a series of uh, documentaries that will highlight Nkana constituency broader you know, perspective. The first documentary obviously will give um, a brief history of what Nkana is. And I think that the subsequent uh, documentary will now delve into Nkana constituents vis-a-vis -vis the potential that Nkana has to offer in terms of business opportunities, in terms of uh, you know uh, opportunities for employment, and just the development that the people of Nkana would like to see. So I'm just very excited because we do not want to allow the information gap to continue widening because you see where there is no information, people perish. Okay, and so we as a media team uh, have thought of closing up that gap for information because there's so much that is happening, there's so much potential that is in Ghana that people are unaware of. And so, you know, uh, people are taking advantage to spread rumors, to spread falsehood, and so we are closing that up. And so, look forward to these documentaries because they will highlight the development that we have embarked on. Our agenda is to give you nothing but development. After all, that is the reason why you we vote each and every time there's an election so that we see a difference from where we were yesterday up to where we expect to be. So look out for the Kana Constituent documentaries that will be starting very soon on different platforms. It will be on social media, that is Facebook, it will be on Twitter, it will be on Instagram, it will be on, on uh, social pages, vis-a-vis uh, -vis WhatsApp. And of course, we are going to go into radio stations as well as TV stations, just so that everybody is aware in Inkana of what is happening. I look forward for that. Thank you so much. Inkana is a constituency of the National Assembly of Zambia. It covers the western part of the city of Kitwe, including the city center and the suburb of Inkana. The constituency was established in 1938 with uh, Albert Smith as the first member of parliament and was originally covering Kasempa, Mwinilunga, Nkana and Solwezi. In 1941, when Martin Viela was the MP under the Labour Party, its borders were redrawn to cover only Chingola and Nkana. In 1948, when George Arik was the MP, it was reduced to covering only Kitwe. In 1957, the name changed to Kitwe West, and then between 1962 to 1968, the seat was abolished and split into Kitwe North and Kitwe South. In 1973, it became Onkana, and David Mwira was the MP under UNIP. Since then, the seat had 10 different MPs until 2021 when Honorable Binwe Mpundu became the Member of Parliament. The constituency is a bustling hub of business with marketing opportunities and with a population of over 200,000 residents. The area is home to major mining operations and other industrial activities, making it a key economical driver for the region. The local community is diverse and dynamic, with a range of cultural and social traditions that reflect the rich history of the area. Despite its many challenges, Nkana constituents continues to strive and grow, offering opportunities for both local residents and those who come from further afield to work and do business in the area. The constituency has a lot of potential and benefit, such as job opportunities, be it supply and subcontracting and employment in the mining sector, like Mopani and Kassiam. For informal sector, Chisokon market is one such trading place and is the largest market on the copper belt at Isiomo. In hospitality, garden court, hotel and lodges, with noble schools like Mukuba Secondary, KTC, MEF, all healthy facilities, 
Kana Hubs Kito St. John Hospital, second in the largest hospital in the Copper Belt. And currently, a number of developmental activities are underway in the constituency with Honorable Binu Mpundu as the current Kana MP.